down to 20. And I ain't got time for no fake ass shit, nigga. I'm straight thug. One, two, three. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Robbie here, YouTube. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's your boy Robbie here, YouTube on a budget. Back with another video, guys. So I'm headed to San Antonio, well, Lockhart, Lockhart, Texas, basically San Antonio, whatever. Uh, I've been driving for about an hour now, and I have about an hour and seven minutes to drive more. Um, the reason why I'm driving out here, y'all comment below, stop right now, comment below, um, yeah, comment below, why am I, I need y'all all to stop, comment below, why do you think I'm driving to Lockhart, Texas, a lot of y'all probably never heard of Lockhart, Texas, um, but I am driving out here though to get something for the charger, and it, you can see the panorama, the panorama roof, uh, guys, panoramic, right? Panoramic, yeah. Um, I'm driving out here for something for the charger. Not going to get installed here. I could. I don't know. We'll see. It, it depends on what time he has. Now, I'm going out here. This is the guy. I don't know if y'all know about my Buick. Um, I had a Buick Park Avenue Supercharge. It was a... a uh, Ultra, I guess that's what you call it back in the day on Ford Auto 26. So this is like 10 years ago, I think. Damn near 10 years ago. Um, and I had my interior done. Right? Custom interior. I have a video go up right about now. Giotto steering wheel, I need to put it in. iPad, AC, base knob, gauges. Just give me any of those lights, man. TVs. <laughs> you crazy. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> TV rack up top, rag top, and then cluster in the dash. disappearing and if I want to drive it out of the car show it goes back up player, Damn. Player. TVs everything custom and of course for Giotto's 4G's yeah so that was the Buick man I missed that car uh, didn't finish it just lost the love of it man and the whole car car club car show scene like, I still go to a car show every once in a while, uh, but the car club crap is over with. I don't do that because it's just messy. Well, I'm not saying the one I was in is messy, but it's a lot of mess going on in car clubs. And I like to move at my own time, my own pace, and I like to go and come as I please. Um, but other than that, that was the Buick. Uh, ben is the guy that actually did all the work on that Buick on the inside. Um, the previous person who did it was uh, artist. I think he locked up. I don't even know what happened to that guy. Uh, but yeah, that's where I'm going to Ben shop. So now, comment below what you think I got going on with the charger. Did you comment yet? I'm waiting. I just want to see what y'all think I'm gonna do. Do y'all think I'm gonna go crazy or what? I see y'all when I get to Lockhart, Texas, and if y'all need some work done, man, holla at my boy uh, Ben. His Instagram will be in the link in the description and all that good stuff. 
Uh, I've been rocking with this dude for years, man. Um, and this is something I needed done on the charger. And we'll see how it looks when I get there. Guys, this is one thing I hate traveling on the highway. If you a truck driver, why do y'all do this shit? Like, why? The speed limit is 70 miles per hour, but I've, I've been sitting behind these two trucks for the last probably two or three miles. Like, one of y'all gotta have enough balls to speed up and get over so I can get my butt by. I hate when they do that. Hey guys. So, people who know me know I'm nowhere near racist. But I need to get my butt back to Houston. This, this is not where my black ass need to be. Uh, I have to make sure I go to speed limit, make sure I put my blinkers on. Um, this is like in the country country. I should have drove my freaking truck. I probably would have fit in. They didn't know who I was because my damn um, windows are so dark. So I should have drove the truck. The reason why I drove the truck, I don't want to drive a truck this far because I know I need um, to rotate the tires, man. But with that being said, I should have drove the truck, bro. Because... I need to hurry up, get my stuff, and go. ASAP. ASAP. And plus, my car don't even need to be in these types of roads. Like, I'm in the back, back of the woods, guys. Like, that damn navigation had me go, like, deep, dark in the back of the damn woods. They trying to get me killed. And they got a little... <laughs> I need her to get my butt back to the highway, bro. I feel way more comfortable. Um, it's sad that I have to, it's, it's just how the world is these days, guys. It's sad that I have to think like that, but I do not belong where I belong. And these people got Trump 2020 everywhere. Are you serious, bro? Like, I've I seen like 30 flags since I've been in this area where I'm at right now. I've been driving here over here for like 15 to 20 minutes. I'm about to make a right on uh, the frontage road. I guess it's the freeway or something. I don't know. Uh, but I've seen a lot of Trump 2020 stuff. I need to get my butt from over here. No cap. No cap. Man, I want to own land, man. But it's like some of these people are hoarders, dude. Like... Oh, they got a single cat. That single cat looks clean. Look at that single cat right there. Dang, y'all can't see it. That single cat clean, bro. They're like on 26s. That mug clean. Nice little house, too. Oh, let me get my stuff back in the way. I ain't trying to get pulled over. Um, I probably won't put this in the video, but I won't keep recording for my safety and my safety only. Yep, you know what I'm saying? That's why I brought extra batteries. All right, guys. So, Molly finally made it to Lockhart, Texas. It's basically, I think it's in between Austin and da uh, Austin and San Antonio, closer to San Antonio. But, Originator Designs. Uh, I'm going to show y'all some work, man. Originator Designs. So, remember, he's the one that did all my Buick work. So, or if, if you use the slabs, he does pop trunk and all that stuff. He does custom full, full front to back, uh, center console. My center console is front to back. And as you can see right here, that's where the seat's going to be cut out for the front and the seat's going to cut out for the rear. Like I said, Austin, man, Austin boys are coming hard. They stepping up there. They coming for these Houston boys, I can see. But yeah, AT, ATX, uh, Blue Line. Shh, I can't say that word. But yeah, so this is a good example of how one of my doors uh, would have looked on a Buick. Close to it, not similar. And this is uh, engraving. He does all that stuff here as well. And what happens, that stuff illuminates, it lights up. So that's the door panel. And this is an Impala, 64 Impala? Yeah. 64 Impala door panel. If you want a small center console. I keep trying to tell my boy Corey to come over here. But here his number is. He does interior fabrication, uh, fabrication, audio interior fabrication, in-house CNC fabrication, in-house etching, engraving, and custom lighting. You can hit him up 
on originatorsdesigns.com, originates underscore who at Yahoo. That's the email, Facebook, and Instagram. And his number is right here, 512-213-8071. So let me show y'all what I came here for. First in the world to do this. Is it already held down? No, oh, it is held down. Guys, look at that. That's for the freaking charger, bro. He's the only one that's going to do this. So if you're trying to get this done, you want to go through me and him only. But check this out. I want y'all to see this, bro. <laughs> that shit going to be hard. That's going to be hard, bro. I'm the first in the world to get this done on a wide body charger. We're going to have fog lights, everything in there. Cutout is on point. Look at that cutout, bro. That shit is going to be hard. Deal. And then not on, on top of that, so y'all know how I have uh, LEDs and all that stuff on top of... Damn, did another one? Hey, on top of that, I'm gonna have to tell him to remove that scoop. That shit don't work. On top of that, you see I have LEDs and all that stuff. Um, before I actually go check out this center console, what's this going into? And, oh, that 96 right there? Yeah. Um, guys, he's like three, three months out right now. But so look at this. This is what I had, not this, but similar in my uh buick man full custom let me go to the other side what kind of rims dubs them, uh, them dubs look good dang i can't go to the other side dang look at that door look at hey man we gotta do something to my charger man we gotta come up with something i don't want to do the thing i did with my buick the full custom thing but we have to come up with something guys look look at this craftsmanship man Man, I, I wish I would have finished my Buick, dude. I know, I know you hate that I didn't, but <laughs> Dow, look, guys, can y'all? Would you look at this? Like, just look how the craftsmanship is. But yeah, guys, this is where I got all my work done. I'm trying to tell y'all, man, y'all better stop playing with my boy Ben. Ninety-six Impala. Look, look at that. Free rear deck, free tuno. What happens if he get out? Then what he gonna do? <laughs> Look at this. This is not turn. This is the car club I used to be in. So check out this console right here. Oh, you guys going? Yeah, I need. I need. Oh, fuck. Hey, I want to ship you the other two. I have two more sets, but I have two people who already want them though. So check this out. So this is gonna be uh stitched like this. Is it gonna be like salt, like the, uh, the uh, material, the uh, upholstery? It's gonna be like the way that bottom lid is. Oh, instead of doing the upholstery, you could just do it like that. Yeah. Oh, it's just straight, no, no, uh, no cushion. Damn, ain't great. I'm trying to tell y'all, man. Look, so he's doing the next one right now. Whoever wants some wide body uh, uh, blinkers. So in mine, I don't have the actual factory LED because I don't have a LED. Because uh, the LED is going to be kind of hard to do, huh? Yeah, with that big assembly. Yeah. So right now, I just have Oracle in mind. But if you do want LED, man, he can make it possible. It's going to take a little longer. It costs a little bit more. But uh, these are probably going to be Corey's right here. And then I got to see me the other one's going to be Dre's. But he getting his shit uh, wrapped right now. Yeah, guys. Fuck with my boy Ben, man. I'm trying to tell y'all if y'all want to be slabbed out. Damn, look at those gauges, bro. But, hey, I like this truck, man. It's like they with explicit or something. This mug is hard. That mug hard, dude. You get the front clip. Get the front clip. Oh, you did that too? Yeah. Oh, damn. Ooh. Hey, this mug like a Silverado. 
Dang, I didn't know you did. So you don't put custom LEDs right here? Yeah, the, the whole headlight will be out of uh, polycarbonate. Oh. So that's just a mock-up out of wood. So is it going to have fiberglass or anything right here? Or? It'll have a clear lens. A cl all the way across or just right here? Just over the, the headlights. And then what's this going to be? Just uh, Oh, is this metal? It's uh, polycarbonate. What the hell is that? It's like the plastic for the headlights. Oh, it's like plastic. Yeah. Damn, that bitch is hard, dude. Y'all about to stop playing with my boy Ben. Man, I want Hey, come on. I, I, I'll be back, guys. Uh. All right, guys. So you saw my boy Ben work, man. I'll be back. Uh, I'm going to do some stuff to my charger. Nothing too crazy. Uh, Low-key, I kind of want to do stuff like that, but I'm not going to mess up this car. Now, the single cab, yeah, maybe. Um, I might actually do the single cab. I might actually do the single cab. Oh, that'd be hard, man. That single cab, bro. Oh, my goodness. I hope this my bank let me get some stuff from here. Usually when I go out of town, it's a hard time to get uh, gas and stuff. But we're going to see. Let's see how much. Damn, that gas is high. Our gas is like two two something there's oh no 269 i guess not bad i need to look for my registration sticker oh here go an extra license plate oh is this my registration sticker oh. no okay Dude, I didn't even know this was in here, bro. Yeah, registration. Dude, I got a sixty-something dollar check. I didn't even know this crap was in here. Yeah, registration sticker right here. So I need to put that one on. Yeah, what's up, dude? <laughs> my, my homeboy. Uh, you ever see my Buick Park Avenue? I, the older one, right? The older one. So it's a dude named Ben. Organi uh, originator uh, design. He he used to be, well, he used to be in Austin. He moved over here, and I was coming to get some fog lights. So I drove over here and picked him up, man. And it's hard, ain't it? It's, it's better in person. People don't think. People don't. <laughs> hey, I'm doing Hey, look, look hold, on, hold on. You want to shout out your Instagram? I don't have Oh, okay, okay. What's your name? Chris. Hey, man, huge shout out to Chris, man. He'll know who he is. Huge shout out to Chris. Yeah, I'm doing a video right now, man. I'm gonna bed, head back to Houston, bro. Hey, man, hey, thank you for the support, bro. All right, appreciate it, dude. All right, man, thank you. Yeah, dude, I got a 60-something dollar check. It didn't even know this crap was in here, bro. Damn, I'm gonna, go to, I'm gonna deposit that. Good thing is, coronavirus going around. I don't even have to uh, go to the bank. I can just do it over my phone. But I'm gonna put this registration sticker on. Oh, the gas stopped at $27. I'm gonna put that registration sticker on, man. And then we finna head back to Houston. Man, huge shout out to Chris, man. Uh, that's crazy, man. I'm in a little country town, bro, and people recognize who you are. That's crazy. I need my receipt though. I need my receipt. Get that receipt. Get a pick, bro. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. You want to get me in it or with, without me in it? Just right there. <laughs> my, my old lady drives an F8. Oh, she does? Yeah. The charger? Yeah. Yeah, man. I just got my wife that uh, Hellcat. She yeah. love it. Yeah. Hey, she would not let me drive that much. Huh? Thanks for raising the fucking bar. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, I appreciate hey, that. hey. Man, my wife, man, so how I, a lot of people saying, man, why you didn't get the Hellcat? You gotta understand, dude, I got the truck, I got the charger, and the single cab's gonna be faster than her Hellcat when I'm done with it. So the single, and the single cab coming out here. And we just got her the F8. Hey, that F8 look good, though. Now, you see what I drive. <laughs> okay, now she wants something else. But no, you take care of her first, 
now you can go get something. It, it was supposed to be my turn. Oh, it's supposed to be your turn? Somebody. Well, I skipped my, my wife. Hey, my wife got skipped a couple times, so I had to, I had to go all out, man. And I told her though, but she would have been fine with a scat pack. But I told her, I went from a V6 to a scat pack. I said, babe, I'm not for We turned one. I had a V6, I had a blue one. I was gonna sell you my uh, cold air intake. I used to stay in CV. Yeah. I okay, I remember you now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Man, that's all I've been watching me, bro. Damn, man, give me some more dab, dog. <laughs> that's, what, that's what I'm saying. I was like, I saw you. I was like, hell, no. Nah, I don't. Hell. Hey, I went to, uh, I went to San Antonio. I bought a new camera. And one dude said the same. He said, what the fuck are you doing way out here? I said, bro, I'm coming to buy a camera. <laughs> And oh uh, yeah, it does stand out too, man. And because uh, every time I drive down the street, people just be. And I'm like, it's just. Like, look like his shit. I said, let me find out he got jacked. <laughs> <laughs> that is. That ain't him, man. We, we, that's the thing. That's on. that's crazy, man. Yeah. So I told her, I told her, um, if we get another Mopar, it's going to be a Hellcat. That point blank period. So I was going to give her this car and give and order the Red Eye Charger. But then I said, it's, it's it's pointless to have two charges. It's just pointless. To me, I think it's pointless. So she said, uh, let's get a Challenger. And my neighbor across the street said, man, y'all should just get a Challenger. It's two different cars. It, it is totally two different cars. It's way different. And then um, she, she wanted to see how it's inside a Challenger looks. So that video, when we were just window shopping, I usually go to the used side because I usually buy my cars used. So I would just... No, the hell that uh no not this one. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I was we were just rolling around and just to go look inside of a challenger, bro. That's all we went to the dealership for. And I seen that mug, I'm like, man, it's a sign, bro. Hey, can you your uh, ceiling? The the, the stars, yeah. I don't know. I, I sold that car, remember? Uh, yeah. No, hell no. I left my Instagram stuff on there to see if they hit me up, but they never did. But it, yeah, it should still work. It's been working for two years. All it is is hooked up from a remote to my amp. That's all I did. I hooked it up to a remote to my amp. So when my car cuts yeah, on, hey, dude, it's easy, dude. It's easy. You, okay, you have two options. You could pay two or three hundred dollars to do it yourself, or you could pay six to seven hundred dollars and have somebody do it for you. Yeah, that uh, what, they, they charge six to seven, eight hundred dollars. Because it's it's a it's, it's a pain in the bitch though, man. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. I think they undercharge. I think they should be charging a thousand. What I thought about doing was just buying another headliner, taking our time. Once we get it, to see how Reach out, dude. Got sunroof. Reach out to Modifex. Ask them because they usually have some already done. Really? Yeah. Been out there. Yeah, hit up Modifix. I ain't going back until January. Okay. I'm stuck out here in Hillbilly Hell. Damn, yeah, man. I, 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 say the, I say the video, I say I need to get my ass from over here like they hang people from my <laughs> 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 All right, dude. Talk to you later, man. All right. Yeah, it's crazy, dog. Oh, man. That's, dude, that is crazy. It, guys, y'all don't. I don't think y'all understand where the hell I'm at, man. Like, I'm in the middle of nowhere. Guys, I don't think y'all, I don't think y'all understand. I'm in the middle of nowhere. And a subscriber. That, man, I don't call them subscribers. I call them supporters, family, man, because y'all just like my family. But that is crazy, man. That is crazy. But off of the head back to Houston, man. Turn left on West San Antonio okay. Street. Yeah, you demanding like my wife. Shit. Calm down. Turn bro. left. Okay. Then turn you... left on West San Antonio Street. I heard you. Hold on. Why is it telling me to turn left now? But yeah, guys. Turn left on West San Antonio Street. Yes, guys. So, man, that's crazy. But yeah, huge shout out to Chris, bro. I'm finna head back to Houston. I think I'm finna go straight to freaking Mod Effects. Honestly, I might end this video, man, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see.